What is happening everybody? John the Realtor here. Welcome to my channel. Today on Raw Real Estate, we are going to talk about my opinion on what is happening in the market today. So let's get started because that's going to happen right now. Hey, all right. So once again, welcome to my channel. Hey, so a little while ago, a few weeks ago or so, I made a video called uh, forbearance and real estate market and my opinion on what was happening you'll see that here that is in my suggested videos now you should go check it out because this video is going to touch on that a little bit and what I think is going to be happening with the market in the next coming months so for my area specifically of Southern California we've seen a lot of mortgage protection just like anywhere else especially due to COVID-19 a lot of people have lost their jobs and so on so they got some mortgage protection to help them through this season but that's going to be coming to an end when we don't know maybe january maybe february we know that the tenant protection got extended for rentals so that is also affecting landlords and the homes that they own so what we're seeing right now is a lot more pre-foreclosure and defaults come in um, which is telling me that we are shifting a little bit so buyers stay tuned because if you're looking to invest it's going to be a good time even though right now the, the interest rates are low it's going to be an even better time if the rates stay the same as values start to go down why would the values go down you say well let's think about this in my last video i explained that once once mortgage protection goes away inventory will rise because today versus 2008 and 9 people have equity so instead of walking away from their homes and um, losing all that equity, people will sell their homes and they will protect that equity. Okay, so what does that mean? What does that mean for today? In my market specifically, we're noticing that inventory is going down a little bit. But the good thing about that is that our pending statuses are also down, which means that the market is level still. Where if pendings were up and inventory was down, or inventory was up and pendings were down, that would not be a good thing because that would mean that either the supply, there's, there's too much supply with not enough demand or too much demand with not enough, as much supply. So right now our inventory is dropping, yes, and our pendings are dropping, which again means that the market is level. So stay tuned because what's gonna happen after the first of the year, in my opinion, we're gonna see values drop a little bit because people, that have specific banks are going to start getting letters from the banks saying that they owe money from the forbearances they had and the mortgage protection that they had because now that bank is going to be pulling the plug if that happens and it will because banks are losing millions of dollars right now in interest we will see a fluctuation in inventory rise which will have our value drop a little bit because people are going to be oversaturated with inventory and when I say people, I'm talking about buyers. If you're looking to purchase a home and right now it's hard for you to find a home, guess what? In the next few months, you're going to have too many homes to look for. So what's going to end up happening is you're going to switch from a seller's market to a buyer's market because as a buyer, you're going to be able to negotiate a little bit more. This might sting a little bit with other professionals out there, but you know what? It's the truth and it's happened before and it's going to happen. So that today is my opinion and my update on the forbearance and what is happening in real estate right now. Leave your comment below. Um, be sure to like and subscribe. Smash that like button as much as you can because we're going to have more videos come out like this. So um, thank you guys so much. And if you have any questions about the real estate market and you're in Southern California, my phone number is right there, right there. Okay. So give me a call. We'll talk to you guys soon. Have a great day.